We have cooperated with Leica Geosystems for 20 years and have bought lasers and pipe lasers. In 2017, we bought the first Foreman solution and the first GNSS solution for the machines. For the preparation of data, it's often the contractor that brings the files to us in the form of DXF or DWG files. We use the surveying company Landsid. They prepare the files for the machine and transfer them to the machines through the cloud-based tool ConX. We use the Foreman solution for a local train station project for the Ishbea municipality. It has really helped us a lot because the project included benches, bus shelters, bike parking, water posts, air posts, curbs and trees, and we could include everything in the project file. If we needed to prepare for a lamp post wire, we could just place a peg, measure it, and remove the peg again so that we don't have 300 pegs everywhere. We start the rover and do the stakeouts. It's very useful in a project like this. We use GNSS on two projects right now, a park project in Ishbea with Ishbea Municipality as contractor. It is a three hectares park. It used to be an area for the repair of trains and the topsoil is polluted. It will be depolluted and repurposed with hills, walking paths and wildflowers. We use 3D to create hills, paths and prepare for the wildflowers. This project was interesting because we were invited to a meeting with the contractor before the project started. We were two companies bidding for the job, and we were consulted first. They had originally made some measurements, but we recommended to use 3D machine control for this project. We often use the products together. We can use the same project files in both the excavator and the rover. The project that we have in Ishbia includes placing marking nets in the soil. This can be done by hand men at the same time as the machine is placed in the other corner. You then just turn on the rover and measure the location instead of having to move the machine from the farthest corner to mark the location. When the project files are the same in the excavator and the rover, they supplement each other well. The rover is used a lot for our as-built documentation. For this project, we perform all the measurements that constitute the as-built documentation and that they can use for their CIS registration. This is our as-built documentation to them and the quality we can deliver with the rover is acceptable for their systems. Before 2017, we often didn't deliver as-built documentation now we can easily transfer them. It's easy to bring the rover and do the measurements on a curb, pavement, or sand cushion that we've created and then transfer the data. Before 2017, we had to wait for a surveyor to come and measure a curb, for example, or to set up pegs that we could work from. 